Hey guys, I'm Wajahat Ahmed and I'm giving you lectures on banking. Um, I have missed one uh, lecture on commercial banking which was uh, cash reserve of banks. So I decided to cover it on my fifth lecture. So what's in commercial bank? So first of all, we have to look at the definition of cash reserve. John Reed says, it is that part of total assets or capital of a commercial bank or financial institution, which is necessary to keep with central bank or itself on form of cash, is called cash reserve. Cash reserves of bank uh, includes three items. First is cash in hand, cash kept with the central bank of country, cash kept with the other banks. Factor determining cash reserve. There are a number of factors that the volume of cash reserve. Some of them are following. Nature of account. The nature of account determines volume of cash reserve. Heavy amount of cash reserve is needed in case of current accounts. In case of saving account, less cash is required. Clearing house. The clearing house facility determines volume of cash reserve. There is need of less cash if a clearing facility is available, otherwise large amount of cash is required. Next is locality. The location of bank determines volume of cash reserve. If a bank is located in village, there is need of less cash. A bank working in city needs more cash. Fourth one is banking habit. The banking habit determines volume of cash reserve. There is demand of less cash if people are bank minded. The payment can be settled through checks. The bank is bound to keep more cash if people do not rely on bank. Fourth one is political stability. The political stability can be examined to determine volume of cash reserve. There is demand for more cash in case of disturbance. When there is political stability, there is need of less cash reserves.